all right guys in order to answer this question we will use the Schwarzschild metric it's s c h w a r z s c h i l d matrix and it's ds square is equal to c d t under root one minus <clears throat> okay it's let me it's one minus two g m divided by r c square bracket close and square minus d r divided by under root 1 minus 2 g m over r c square bracket close square minus r d theta square minus r sine theta sine theta and d phi square so guys uh, we can uh, call it as equation one it's equation one now to determine the area of the event hori horizon uh, event horizon uh, that is the spher uh, spherical surface at r is equal to r s where r s is the uh, schwarzschild radius since the event horizon is a spherical surface therefore dr is equal to zero in expression one and leaving the spatial part of the matrix as minus r d theta square minus r sine theta d phi square Thus, the difference element of the area of the spherical surface equals dA is equal to R d theta multiplied by R sine theta d phi is equal to R square sine theta d theta d phi so we can substitute r is e with r s for event horizon and integrate expression uh, number two this is our expression number two for standard spherical angles phi and theta so a is equal to r r square s and integration of from range phi is equal to 0 to 2 pi d phi and integral of sine theta d theta, uh, d theta the range is 0 to pi is equal to 2 pi r s square minus cos theta from 0 to pi and the answer is a is equal to 4 pi r square 
s so guys this was uh, the explanation of this question i hope uh, you have understood all the parts thoroughly and it was easy for you to understand thank you very much